Tyler, the first signing of 2022-23. How happy are you to be here? Yeah, obviously I'm really looking forward to it. Um, you know, I've worked with the manager for a, for, for a few years now and obviously the assistant as well. Um, so yeah, it's, it's not far from my home, so it was, a, it was a no-brainer to come here, really. Tell us a bit more about, obviously, your Southampton-born lad. You know you've played for clubs across the National League around here. What's this experience going to be like for you now? Um, pretty much the same, really. Um, obviously, I still want to kick on in my career, and um, I know the manager really well, and he, he, he will get the best out of me, I know that for sure. Um, and I just I know how big of a club this is, and I know... Obviously, what the fans want—they they, they really want to get back in the in the football league. Obviously, it was a disappointing last season for them. Um, so I just hope um, I can come here, make an impression on the squad, and um, put in really good performances. And then hopefully we can be like the little surprising team. Obviously, you're central defender by trade, but what sort of position, what sort of player would you say you are? Um, <laughs> I, I mean, I like heading the ball. Um, I'm good in the air, I'd say. Um, you know, I'm a ball playing centre half as well. Um, I'm, I'm predominantly right footed, but I play on the left side of the of any of the three of of a two. Um, I prefer playing left side, so I can use my left foot really well. Um, I'm, I'm a leader on the pitch. You know, I'm aggressive. So yeah, I'd say I'm an all round just a natural centre half really. Yeah, you're 23 years of age, but you've got a lot of experience at this level and also in League Two as well. How important is that going to be going into next year? Um, yeah, obviously I'm still young. I'm only 23, but um, like you say, I've played. I played. A good amount of games I'd like to say I'm an experienced young lad so um, you know hopefully I can bring that into the team obviously we're going to have a lot of young players I, I, I think and um, yeah hopefully we're going to be fresh we're going to be we're raring to go for the start of the season so um, yeah I'm really looking forward to it. Playing alongside a defender you know well already Corey Jordan how important is that partnership going to be? Yeah massive obviously last season I couldn't really build on a partnership um, due to like injuries and things so um, obviously I've known Corey for years you know I know how he plays inside and out um, he's a great centre half so you know, it'd be good to reunite with him again, and um, yeah, the the chemistry will will sure still be there, and um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to playing with him. It does seem to be a bit of a Bournemouth connection now, with obviously yourself, Corey Moles as well. So it's you know, with the success Bournemouth have had, it's only going to be positive for us as well. Yeah, I don't think we're going to go straight up up again, but um, you know, yeah, it's 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 always easier when you're when you're coming into a club and you know people. Um, obviously, we all know how the manager works and how he wants to play, so it's. On the first day we come back, we're already a step ahead sort of thing. So, um, you know, it's, it can only be good for us and um, good for him to bring people in that he knows and knows that we're going to suit his style. So I think we're looking forward to it. Yeah. You mentioned how the manager works there. What are you expecting from him next season? Um, big things, big things from the manager. Um, no, obviously, I think we're going to be playing really attacking football, um, try and play on the floor as much as we can. Um, and um, he will work us hard every day, and he, will, he, he, you know, behind the scenes, I think everyone knows how how hard he works. Um, I don't think he gets enough credit for that. Um, you know, everything, every little detail, he will make sure he gets perfect, and um, that will reflect on the squad. Obviously, your main priority is keeping the ball out the net, defending, but also you are a threat from the other end as well. You've got a number of goals at this level as well. So, how important is that going to be going forwards? Yeah, obviously, I, I, I want to add more. I don't feel like I've got enough over the years for for the height I am. Um, but there will be a season where I where I do score quite a few, and I, hopefully it's going to be next season. Yeah. Just finally, what are your goals and targets for next season? Um, just to make a good impression, um, start start the season really well. Um, you know, um, get as many wins as we can, get some goals hopefully. Um, but the main thing is we get the, the start of the season right, and we we go out with a bang and get as many wins as we can.